you're trying to install a dash cam on a BMW and you, you want to hot wire it into the car with three leads, the ground, the constant power, and the ignition power, you can have a hard time trying to find a fuse that, that does that uh, because most of these fuses get, get turned off in 15 minutes and there's a lot of people who struggle trying to hot wire it. There's, there's a really simple way to, to get this done to identify which wire it's going to give you that constant voltage that you're looking for. I'll make a really short video to show you how to do it. This happened to be an X5 BMW, but this method that I'm showing you will work for any BMW. Matter of fact, it, it should work for any car. So this is how it's going to get done. So you can see that I got my camera already hooked up, ready to go, the rear camera already installed. And I'm trying to hot wire it, so it's going to have a constant voltage that is going to uh, take the video at all time whenever it sends movement uh, from that particular camera and so when you buy the hot wire kit it comes in three leads you get the negative and then of course you get the constant power that always on that's yellow and then the red one uh, would be the ignition and you can str struggle with trying to find a fuse that you can tap into and you know once you find that fuse it's really simple and this comes with a kit or you can go to automotive automotive store and get it all you need to do is just pull up the fuse that you want to tap into plug this in and and uh, find a proper fuse for it this this one happened to be five amps but if you tap into a 10 amps just put the 10 amps in here and um uh, that that should be it and uh so now I'm going to show you how to identify which one is a constant lead. And so what I did was I, I opened the car up and uh, wait for 15 minutes. So you know that the car is off and there's nothing on right now. Now I try to put in something in the cigarette lighter, no power. And there's no power anywhere in the car. So I know the car is off. And just to, to give you some proof, the light should be on when I plug this in, right? This is the cigarette lighter that's supposed to power the camera. And you don't see any light at all. So there's no power coming out of that. So I know the car is off. Now, to identify which wire, first you're going to need a voltmeter. Something like that. You can get any brand, it's fine. You can uh, ground it. So. For me, I know this bolt is bolting to the frame, so I know that's a good source of ground. So I'm gonna ground it. Now I'm gonna look for a constant power. So since most of the fuse, this is X5 location for fuse box. For your application, you gotta go find the fuse box. So for me, that's where it is. And all I did was on this lead right here, I'm just gonna poke into these so the fuse has two electrodes, one on each side that's exposed metal that you can you can tap on. And you can see it says zero there. Every time I tap into one of these, it should, it should say zero, right? Because the car is already off. So most of this is zero. As you're moving along, and on this one, if I click on this fuse right here, check it out. It says, 12.62 so I know that's live when the car is off it's that simple guys just go look for that fuse so this one if I looked it up and I print this out from online of course and this shows that it's fuse number 50 and so I look up the, the cross reference for what number 50 is uh, let me see where is that okay so here it is Let's see if I can get some lighting in here so number 50 so is a instrument cluster now if I stick into the 52 no power so this is 7.5 uh, amps right so that's bigger amperes I bet you this is powering the entire cluster this is for memory so for things like you know the uh, the the computer what it is that need to re retain memory and this to stay on all the time that's what it is so i'm gonna tap the here that's it guys very simple 
should work for any BMW or any car. Uh, it, it's that simple. Once you locate it, you can tap into it and you can get it done. Now I do have a full video of, of this installation. Uh, if you like to look into that, uh, but I, I, this is just to show you the quick way of identifying which one is the, the constant power lead. At the end of the video, I'm going to attach a link to a full video installation of the dash cam for this particular vehicle is X5 BMW 2016. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you like the content, please like and subscribe. Thank you.